Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm just gonna go ahead and jump right into this little makeup look and I'm gonna start off with the moisturized face and my eyebrows are already done. I'm just gonna take the Laura Mercier translucent powder and I'm going to set my face first because I want uh, more of a dewy look afterwards. So if I set my face first, uh, the moisturizer will absorb most of the setting powder and then the rest will help when I put the foundation on so I don't have to set my entire face. Okay, for foundation today, I'm going to be using the Fiona Styles foundation. I am in the color 9. Um, I think they're actually discontinuing this. I got it from Ulta. It was like $7 because they're discontinuing it there. I don't know if they're discontinuing it everywhere or just at Ulta, but it was only $7, so that's why I got it. And then because we want to add a little glow to our face, because that's the whole purpose of this makeup look, I'm going to use this Peach Deluxe. It's Sandra Deluxe collab with Melanie Mills, and it's just like a body gleam. You can use it all over your body, but I'm going to mix it in with my foundation today. So you only need a little of that, like literally a little goes a long way, or you walk around looking like you're reflecting everything. I think I'm gonna use this Milani bronzer. Do I wanna use this one? Actually, I'm gonna use my NYX bronzer. I lost the top, I don't know where it is. First. Then to conceal under my eyes and highlight and stuff, I'm going to be using the Tarte Shape Tape in the color Tan Sand. Okay, to set just my under eyes, I'm going to be using the Sasha Buttercup Powder. Sasha Buttercup Powder. And I just like to press this into my skin. I'm not going to bake with it. Okay, and then to chisel out a little bit more, I'm going to take this NYX Contour Palette and I'm going to mix this shade with this one. take whatever is left and just kind of do my nose just a little for eyes I'm not really doing anything I'm just going to be using this Carly Bible palette and I think I'm going to just use this shade right here and only apply it to my crease For a little bit of blush, I'm gonna take this BH Cosmetics blush palette and I'm going to take this one because it's kind of like, um, it has like a shimmer to it and that's what I want because I want to go that way.
For highlight, I'm gonna be a little bit extra now today and I'm gonna take this Sunbeam uh, by Benefit and I'm just gonna put a little bit on the high points of my cheeks. And then I'm going to go into the Carly Bible palette again and I'm going to mix these two colors right here. And then I'm gonna do a really thin wing liner and I'm going to apply these lashes. I threw the box away, um, but these are Tarte lashes. I think they're called Center of Attention. Uh, so I'm just gonna apply these lashes and then finish up my eyes when I get back. Okay, so lashes are on, eyeliner is also on. I'm gonna go back into the Carly Bible palette and I, if I could find the brush. I'm just going to highlight the inner tear duct and underneath my brow bone using the same two highlighters down below. And I know that just fragments of a world where your absence all I get to see. Take me back to the planet, the planet where you and I are still meant to be. Cause I'm in when you for lips, I'm going to use MAC Spice, and this is Revlon. I have no, Rosy Future, I guess, maybe? Super Lustrous Lip Gloss in Rosy, what did I say? Rosy Future, I think. <laughs> Actually, that's too pink for me. I'm gonna add MAC Cork on top of that. And then to set my face, I'm just using the Mario Badescu Rose Water mixed with a little bit of vegetable glycerin. Actually, I need to brush my eyebrows out because they're turning gray from all the foundation. 